Hello everybody, welcome back to Born Losers Gaming and welcome back to Hive Swap. This is a very special episode of Hive Swap because we're recording it on 413. And in theory, it should also release on 413. Yeah, because it's going to get edited in, in <laughs> 10 minutes once we're done at recording it. Everyone, welcome back to Hive Swap. I want to start here. This is the first part of a brand new session. The reason I want to start here is because it, clearly this is not... Yeah, How this it is was originally. This this is not our this is not our lovely wife. This is not my lovely wife. This is not, not my lovely anyway. brother. <laughs> yeah, I mean we 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 we, <laughs> we swapped hives. We swapped them hives Honest, so okay. hard. When you say it like that, like swapped hives, that sounds like something's gone wrong. It does. Yeah, I mean, something has got. Let's get back into the game. Can you imagine like a honeybee swapping hives with like <laughs> a hornet? True. I forgot my safe slots. Kitchen, looking for pigeon food, which is fine. That makes sense. New world, new me. That's me, Does baby. Does that say pidigeon? Pidigeon? It might say pidigeon. You don't know. We don't know what it says. <laughs> All right. So we left off in a brand new world. Wow, we got a full the snakes inventory are going, and stuff. Oh, what's going on? The snakes. They're going, oh. Where do you see snakes on the screen? Top left. Oh, <laughs> you're right. You're totally right. Here, I'm going to put the pigeon okay. in the snake. Stop. I People have said, from what I've read in the comments, that there's quite a few things, right? Like, yeah. Like, we can, like, use stuff on almost anything, and it'll get a response. Like, throw pigeon into thing. <laughs> Byers regards the shimmering portal with the same day's cluelessness with which he regards everything else in existence. He is endearingly democratic. Any stupidity. Oh, I'd like to start doing that a bit more, just to see like little bits, right? Like what happens if I interact with this and that? Because you know what? what? That's the whole point of these games, right? It's just to read the dialogue. What is this pigeon's real name? B uh, Byers. It's Byers. not. It's not Byers. Oh, it's not. Oh, does 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 J Jude have a different name for it? Yeah, uh, Jude was screaming Byers, but it wasn't the pigeon's name. This is the loathsome pigeon that Jude hated with That's... everything he had. Well, it's not on his planet anymore, so he should feel happy about it. You're awful slam the growls coming from the other side of this door. You aren't even going to... Well, all right. Oh, I bet this world also has the guck monsters, right? Oh, probably, but... And it's a it's a troll world, so they probably just shoot them. <laughs> oh God! I mean, you're actually, right. Well, let's go to the door that isn't. This is um, it was like that Alternia. It's jelly. Shut up. Is this Alternia, by the way? Uh, I mean, we don't even know if the other one's Earth, because it kind of seems like it might be post game. Yeah, I mean, with how how the game works, you know, it could be literally anything. So yeah, we don't it could know. be a new reality. We, it's weird. You have no idea how to open this thing. You don't even see a handle. If you had to guess, it looks like it's automatic, but the power seems to be off in here. You think. It's kind of hard to tell. I'm going to throw my batteries at it. Does it seem like the power's off? It looks Better. pretty darn bright. That's true, actually. Why is our flashlight on, actually? I guess because the power's supposed to I be mean, off. Yeah, it's probably darker than it actually seems. If you hit inside this crate, you'd think, you'd think you'd be nervous that it was somehow going to suddenly close up around you, and you'd be left screaming in the dark in a slimy box somewhere impossibly far from your home. Yeah, this box looks terrible. Yeah, it doesn't look like a good box. So you don't think you'll be hiding in the crate just now. I like that uh, little alien partially covered in the blanket going, Ah! You are seeing so the top much right. on the screen. Oh, ah, yeah. Why well, is everything right. in the corners of the screen going, ah? <laughs> I mean, you're just right, actually. Oh, that's a dead robot in the bottom left. <laughs> yes, it is. Futuristic looking door in a gloomy, futuristic looking bunker like place. Maybe all the answers are through here, which would be good, except for the fact that the power's out. Uh, didn't we? Oh, is that a ray gun? Oh, I want a gun. It's another gun. This one looks a lot more sophisticated and deadly than your PA's weaponry, which you left back at the attic. You think you'll leave this one where it is, too? Yeah, it's, it's, screw just, that equipment. Just going to keep calling Pa oh. PA, huh? Oh, <laughs> that's a new recording session. You don't <laughs> think so. Looks kind of weird, but it's still plainly a gun. That's interesting. I would love to see this world if... Uh, you know, had maybe Jude... Does Jude use guns? Uh, Jude used a flare gun, so well, yes. Well, all right. You don't know how to drive this thing. It doesn't seem to be on anyway. Man, nothing in this world. Oh, my guess is the oh. troll's going to use a gun. Oh, well, I bet, yes, I totally think you're right. That exactly hurt, but it was kind of tingly. You don't think you'll be able to reach the portal while that force field's on. Unfortunate. Uh, the shy, uh, emotionally abused troll seemed to have hinted that there was a way to turn the power on around here. Yeah. Oh, you place all ten of your fingers on the back of the tablet and approach the control panel. Oh, that was the control panel. Yeah, this that's little, it. Oh my god, it's tiny. Hey, so we got a password entry program appeared on the screen. 
Oh uh, my yeah, gosh. Yeah, baby. Why is this like every edgy middle schooler's Yahoo <laughs> I am icon? <laughs> You're actually right. Oh my God. MSN, never. Yahoo, absolutely. Oh, oh God. My, you're just playing Snake. Okay, cool. Well, or I need the 10? Neopets version, which I forget the name at the moment. Oh my God. Am I really Mirka just going to Chase? Was it Mirka Chase? I'm not. Listen, uh, don't bring me into your Neopets, Join okay? Join me in Neopets hell. Oh finally. my God. <laughs> I'm already a filthy homesick, so I might as well join the ranks of Neopets Listen, as well. Listen, Neopets is great. So is homesick. Hello? Except they uh, they sold Neopets to a company. Because originally it was like a college student's project. I'm the snake master. You did... Um, power? I was about to say, this almost looks worse than when I first got here. Yeah, it actually doesn't look... <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, oh, hey! Well, that's not a, a darn thing at all. Oh! <gasps> Oh, that's me right now. Oh, my God. That's the cutest thing I've ever seen in my... Oh. <laughs> that is the coolest looking thing I've... She was not as enamored with it as we were. Uh, well, I am, so she needs to get her ass back there. Go. <laughs> no way. If you wanted to get killed by a weird monster in the basement, you would have stayed home. You know what? True. Fair enough. Are those bullets in the background? Giant bullets. Let's send you out this way. Oh, look, there's a freaking scrolling uh, wallpaper on the computer. <laughs> oh, there is. It's super cute. Hello. Oh, I can't look at it. So it looks like this is probably some of his friends. Some of their, whoever they are, their friends. Yeah, you'd think somebody who's like paranoid Radical. and living in a bunker wouldn't like put close connections as a screensaver. True. Well, I wonder if the other person is uh, the person on the tablet. Which I think, I think whenever it's blinking, we could probably click on it and get a little dialogue. Yeah, this them. is the other person, right? Uh, this is uh, this is uh, this is uh, uh, Joey. Right. This is uh, them, and you were Joey, and I was them. Yeah. Hey. Uh, hey, Xerox, are you there? I don't know how I feel about the codename Xerox. It's pretty close to Zephros, do you think? I mean, I imagine I called you. Damn it! Not that I would ever do that. Sorry. <laughs> oh, uh, I don't really know what to say to any of that. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> uh, it's fine. Stop apologizing. Me. It's actually really amazing. Nope. The hold on. exact hold opposite on. of hold that, on. actually. Hold on. <laughs> it's actually really annoying when you do that all the time. What? For your information. Oh. Sorry. Uh, forget <laughs> about it. <laughs> I wanted to ask you about the security console. I played a game on it, but all that happened was the forklift drove. <laughs> okay. Uh, the forklift drove straight into the force field and exploded. Yep. Whoa, your forklift exploded? Yeah. It's not mine, though. Is it yours? I'm sorry I wrecked it. No, of course not. Or, I mean, do you want me to take it? Because it's broken? I would have mind. I mean, whatever. Up to you. Uh, all right. Uh, and then a weird monster uh, menaced me, Min menaced, yep, menaced. menaced me menaced? <laughs> uh, into this room, and there's only one door. This is kind of a bad situation. Weird monster? Uh, yeah, the deer cat thing. Deer cat thing? Are you having a fight with your Lucis? Not that it's any of my business. Oh, oh. options. So should we just continue to, like, I mean... <sighs> Let's go Lus Lucis. Yeah, Lucis? Lucis? Is that what you call that thing? I barely got away with my life. <laughs> Wait a minute. Are you actually not Tetradamic? No, I'm Joey. Joey Claire. Holy crap, that's a long one. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. There's a bunch of big computers and boxes, and I don't know where I am, who you are, uh, but... You kept acting like you knew what was going on? Yeah, and just for clarification, we are so unfortunate in a way that Casey can't get too close to the monitor, so that's why it's like when there's I, a big thing of dialogue, listen, it's like... this game has been great so far. The fact that they put white text with no shading on a very <laughs> similar colored big block, I'm not hey, a fan are, of it. Mine are fine. Mine's big, bright red. It's I great. know, the bright red is fine. <laughs> well, what are you doing with Tetrarch's tablet? Do you mean this Trapper Keeper laptop? I found it on the floor. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Is Cedric Damick there? Maybe I could talk to him instead. Please. Please give the tablet to Cedric Damick. Please. 
I don't know who Tetrarch Damic is. I don't know who you are. <laughs> Could you look for him, please? Okay, yeah, I'll just r root around in this room that's filled with guns. <laughs> okay, thanks. <laughs> 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 Sorry. <laughs> it's just, it's really nice to read Homestuck dialogue again. Oh, shit. Look, it's one of them robot thingies. This one up here? Yeah. Yeah, I guess you're right. And then this is like something. Oh my God, there are guns everywhere, actually. Yeah, there's there's a lot of guns. But this looks like human guns, too. I mean, this is just like an M16. These are guns. It's going to be a map, but you don't recognize the shapes of any of the landmasses depicted on it. Or, well, actually, now that you think about it, they maybe do look kind of familiar? But you're not sure where you would have seen them before. Huh. Oh, okay. That's actually... That's something. Uh, remember when we first arrived here, uh, she picked up the thing and she was like, I kind of recognize this blueprint, but that makes oh, no sense because right. I've never been here before. Was that... The, the, the thingy, the, the, the symbol up there. I don't know, man. I wasn't huh. looking at it. Okay, we'll see if it comes up again. You don't really know what this is all about. You would kind of like to never find out. Please. I mean, yeah, I actually kind of say, I'm like, this is, it was like pretty terrifying. It's a big, scary robot. Yeah, really. Can I take any of these guns? I know you don't like guns at all, but. Yeah. Oh, uh, I know. Like that, this. The, 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 yeah, what's your name? The oh. con condescence. Yeah, the thing I could ever pronounce. Wow. Is this how Byer sees the world? From high overhead, his powerful brain calculus. <laughs> oh, you couldn't keep that up any longer. I like using Byers on everything I, I like possibly Byers. can. I like Byers. Oh, you don't want to show that thing to buyers. You'd rather not deal with his fluttery terror poops right now. No. Same. Why? How do you know that he has fluttery terror poops? They live together. They probably know these things. She doesn't even know its name. Are you sure it's not named Byers? I'm pretty sure its name's not Byers. Okay, because I mean, just making sure because like we're only calling it Byers right now. Well, yeah, because we called it. Jude said Byers. Byers means something, right? I don't know. Byers just sounds like a name. I don't know. Oh, I'll figure it out later. Yeah, I know, right? Uh oh, 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 I'm looking at stuff. There we go. Ooh. Oh. Oh, look, it's an um That's a lot of blood. That is a lot of blood, actually. You don't really know what any of this stuff is, but it all makes you extremely uncomfortable. Like the tablet, you seem to be able to read the text, but you'd kind of rather not. Hmm. Okay, interesting. There's a, a bloody sea dweller. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, like a one of the higher high bloods. Yeah. I don't really know what it means. Wow. And then what? What is this up here? Okay, yeah, that's nope, nope, nope. That's fine. It's it's okay. It's it's get out of my face. What oh, did I you do? Clearly, just hit the return button. That that makes sense. More stuff. Another, Another one. I looks think it's like, the same one. So reminds me of Jude's dorky conspiracy theories. Although you guess maybe the, those weren't actually conspiracy theories. More like conspiracy facts, apparently. Except for that thing about Clinton's pregnancy. <laughs> well, um, all right, if you think so. You guess the same may go for all of this stuff, but jeez, did these dorks have to always dig themselves into such a crazy bones hole? What with the layered scrawls and everything? That's true, like... It's a very <laughs> messy way to live. <laughs> Look at this. I like that they doodled. I know. What is presumably themselves. I know. And then, hello? Okay, so this guy is the one with sunglasses. Yes, yes, Because yeah. we passed by them. Mm -hmm. That is 100%. So then that probably means that this other one that doesn't have the sunglasses... Is probably the troll. Our, our nervous life? little friend. Yeah. Who really just. <laughs> I'm concerned about them, you I know? know? It's blinking again. Should we talk to them again, probably? Uh, yeah. I, I've exhausted everything I've done in this room. Yeah, well, fine. They're a little weird. Yeah. Did Did you find them? No. <laughs> yeah. I didn't even need to see it. <laughs> oh, no. I don't know what to do. What should I do? Oh, my God. <laughs> Why on earth are you asking me? What's Earth? What? Okay. Oh, my God. <laughs> Jude, is that you? <laughs> yes, I have been messing with you this entire... <laughs> this is another one of your stupid practical jokes. This isn't funny. No, I'm Zephros. Okay, Zephros, tell me what's going on. <laughs> I, um, I don't really know. Actually, I'm kind of upset because you're yelling and that makes it harder to think. I know I'm not very smart or good at anything, but I really am trying my best. I'm sorry. I can't believe that. <laughs> Joey, can you just sure, you be nice? Down. I know. Like, I know you got teleported and you might get eaten by a lion, but that's not a reason to it's be rude. It's not a reason to be rude. Absolutely. I come to think of it, now that I've said that situation out loud, maybe <laughs> I wouldn't be very polite either. 
Uh, I'm the one who just got shot through space into an alien nightmare horror house, and you expect me to make you feel better? We also just got an achievement down here, which helps me feel better that we're actually doing the right thing, which is good, because we're 15 minutes in, and I feel like I've done nothing. Uh, I feel like a lot of like point, point and click, click adventures yeah. are going to end up feeling like that. Look, we all have self-esteem issues. <laughs> Joey? <laughs> uh, this is but true. The, but there's a time and a place for pathetic. Yeah! <laughs> okay. Uh, pathetic groveling, and it is not while I'm trying <laughs> to not be devoured by alien monsters. Sorry, I'm reading ahead, and it's just funny. <laughs> read it out loud as you read ahead. <gasps> Wait. You're an alien? <laughs> I'm two seconds away from throwing this disgusting joke machine into any one of the several of massive piles of armed and dangerous garbage around me. Wait, no, don't. This is so exciting. I've never met an alien before. I'm like seriously losing it. Most trolls never meet aliens until they go off planets to conquer them. What? <laughs> oh, okay. But like, you could be messing with me. Are you messing with me? The Tetrarch says I have to stop being so trusting. <laughs> oh, I know. Say something only an alien would say. Uh. <laughs> I'm gonna tap dance your sad little nerve. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, hey, I didn't say you could uh, say it that. Doesn't matter. It's the only I'm gonna tap dance your sad little nerd body into the ground if you don't cut this stupid baby nonsense right now. That's. Did you understand what I was asking? That was sort of a normal thing to say. <laughs> yeah, that's. It, I don't care. That's a very normal troll thing to say, especially <laughs> since say this. It. Why did you say you were from it planet was, Earth? It was so good. Yeah, you had to we see what just happened. agreed together that we shouldn't bully this poor thing. Well, I had to one last time. No, it wasn't. That was not a nice thing to say at all. Uh, sorry. It's this is all a little nuts, and the deer cat maybe got me a little rattled. So you're not an alien. No, I am. I mean, if this seriously is an Earth, which between the snake machines and the deer cat and the sci-fi technology, I'm willing to believe. Plus, there was some other monster earlier, so I'm having that kind of day. Monsters? Yeah, I managed to get past them, barely. Wow, you're so cool. You're like on a real adventure. Wait, what color is your blood? <laughs> uh, what kind of question is that? I'm so sorry. I don't mean to be disrespectful. I just want to be sure I knew before I made a mess of things. Uh, okay. It's red? Ah! Uh, X, al almost XD. Just throwing that out there. Get rid of the colon. It's a bit, mm, it's a bit back to the good old days. Really? Me too! Awesome! We can even be friends. This is so cool. Hey, maybe I can even help you. How? Uh, the Tetrax Lysis knows me. Uh, he'll calm down if I can get over there. Uh, by Lysis, you mean the deer cat thing? Uh, yes. Well, that's wonderful. Thank you. Yeah, except, um, I don't know. I'm still worried this might all be a big test. A test? I don't follow. Sorry. Boy, it's getting kind of frustrating having to say <laughs> that over and over. <laughs> the Tetrarch is always testing me. If this is the final... Z uh, if this exam. Is the final, like, oh, <laughs> I get it. This is the final exam of secrecy stuff, and I'm blood. He's going to be really disappointed. Oh, I know. If you can prove you're an alien, I'll come over and help you out. Uh, do you want me to say more alien things? No, I mean, I, I have no way to verify if those are true or not. Um, oh, send me a picture of you. <laughs> uh, if you're on the internet and somebody just asks for a picture of you... Don't, uh, don't send them a picture. Don't do that thing. Especially if they're saying that like they're an alien, like, just... Just don't, like, listen, this isn't a good idea. Yeah, it's not. Photoshop exists. They can make <laughs> you think they're Megamind. I uh, wish I could talk to Megamind. I don't have any photos with me. Uh, and anyway, how could I get it to you? I'm trapped in here by that monster. Aren't you using this Tetrax tablet? Take the pics with that and... and ex 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 Xmit? Which one is... Th uh, what is that trying to be? I don't Just know. Just Xmit it over? All right. Uh, pics? pics? Xmit? Pictures, transmit. <laughs> okay. Okay, it's kind of a uh, weird ask, Xerox. <laughs> but I'll give it a shot. Here goes. Selfie time. <laughs> oh, oh. Okay, that's. Oh, did we just switch? Oh, maybe. Oh, they're a cutie patootie. They are. <gasps> Your name is Zephros Trito. You're having. Sorry, I'm probably butchering these names. 
You are having a difficult evening, just one of many in a predictably difficult life because you are a rust blood, because you are rust blood trash. Oh. Damn game, calm down. These houses are cool as shit. They are cool. You just witnessed beams of red and green energy erupt from the hive of your... I'm, I'm like still in his voice, Jesus. You just witnessed the beams of red and green energy erupt from the hive of your best friend, Tetrarch Demek, right before a squadron of Imperial drones snatched up half your neighbors. So it's safe to say your revolutionary efforts are not going great. Uh-oh. Oh. Oh. And it seems you've received a package. The houses glow... Uh, according to the blood color, it looks oh, like. Oh, maybe. You could totally be right A on that. A little interesting that blue, rust, well, orange, no. and green all live near each other then. No, I don't think it's true because Tetrarch Damage Hive is the one that's green and he's uh, orange. So, think I don't, so? Yeah, because like if you look at the with the tablet, right? His is red uh, background and then Tetrarch's is orange. Oh, fair. Uh, you hope he's in one of the parts that have him been annihilated by massive beams of light. Okay, that's really interesting. Well, we got a package. Let's look at it. It's a delivery from Scythian with or Scythian. What did I say Scythian? With the Scythian. item you ordered quite a long time ago. You guess it arrived during all the confusion. Yeah, what up? Don't you think it's it's gotta be either yellow or brown, right? Or I don't think orange is a blood color. Whatever, yellow whatever they are, they, it's orangish, brownish. Tor whatever uh, freaking Tavros's color was. Brown. Fine, brown. It's close to orange. It is brown. It's orange. So is the FLARP manual. This edition of FLARP is focused on spy games, intrigue, and rebellion. Tetrick Demek modeled a lot of his underground resistance ideas after this system. Ah, a bunch of nerds. <laughs> a bunch of, yeah, let's get in there. I don't have to look into the building before entering it. Hello, I am, in fact, a cutie. You are a cutie. Oh, your house is sick. These hordes are pretty, like, standard. Just like They're just kind of like hordes, but they're huge. Yeah, that feels like kind of the point, right? Yeah. Is, Man, like, this is... this uh, character is a bit of a plain Jane sort yeah. of character. What, do I just bend spoons for a living? Oh, I bet you have telekinesis. Oh, you use these to practice your bunny powers of telekinesis. You still aren't very good yet, but you sure show these spoons who's boss. I'm going to bend one right Wait, now. Wait, that's awesome. You don't use your hands to bend spoons. You use the power of the imagination. By which you mean your weak, unreliable psychic powers. Oh. Shit, dude. Uh, your wear grid study scroll. To be honest, only indigos really care about what fork goes where, and they crush anything they pick up anyway. Oh. True. You pretty much got this memorized already. It's like uh, fork, fork, mega fork, micro fork, knife fork, fool's fork. Uh, that about covers it. What are you eating that you require a fool's fork? <laughs> what is a fool's fork? You know what one is? What you have like a bunch of billiard balls hanging from your ceiling in light form, and that's uh, cool. Oh, you're right. And then up on the wall too, up here. Yeah, Interesting. So I guess we're big into billiards. Is that a poster of us and our sunglasses friend on the wall? It kind of looks like it, right? That's, that is what it looks like. That's weird. There's a weird amount of green and uh, I mean, I don't really, you know, the billiards. I mean, yeah, English, it's very that. Lord English. Lord English, whatever. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's not good. Just don't like that. Oh, yeah, baby. Sport. You play pusher, of course. Burgundies are ideally suited to this position because of their telekinetic powers and their ability to commune with dead what? With dead players. Also, pusher is the most dangerous position, and no one really cares if rust bloods get killed. All right. That's brutal. This place sucks. Yeah, it's not good. Okay, so I guess that's why it's there was pictures of billiards balls on that poster. Mm. So I guess it's a sports thing. This is roughly around when you might normally be going to sleep, but the current circumstances, i.e. your imminent death if you don't escape, are not conducted to sleep. They are conducted to dying, though. All right, oh. maybe we should be a little faster then. Let's look at the computer. I'm assuming the, that's what we've been using this to communicate. Not to not to keep talking about Homestuck in a Homestuck game. Sure. But this seems like a lot nicer of a house than the Homestuck trolls had. It's kind like, of true. Their houses were very... Uh, just like messy and empty. Well, if I also remember the the was it the beta trolls, which was like Carcat and all them, they lived on a pretty shitty alternia. Didn't the alpha trolls live on a pretty nice alternia? Did we get to see their houses? We didn't get to see their houses, but we got to hear about like their world. And if I remember, their world wasn't that bad. Yeah, but it I was might like be wrong. it was like more peaceful. Yeah, so I mean, you know, it could be something along that line. I like, mean, except for the fact that people are getting kidnapped and murdered, and yeah! no one cares if they die. Except for that. It's your tablet. You use it pretty much for everything. Your auto tune mic is plugged into it. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh. I'm playing over the mic. You gather both tablet and mic with one practice motion. 
They're attached, so the motion probably didn't require as much practice as you might think. You then proceed to have this conversation again from the other side. It's all news to Zephyros, but it'd be a little dull to read the whole thing over again. Oh. Let's just pick up where we left off. Oh, okay, that's fair. Oh, uh, did you want me to say more alien things? No, I mean, I have no way to verify if those are true or not. Oh, so this is what we just read. Yeah. Send me a picture. I don't know any photos with me, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, send pics, pics transmit. Yep, all good. Here goes. Oh, that's a bad picture. <laughs> that's a bad picture. This looks like a fake, fake, like, like oh, look at these aliens, right? <laughs> oh, yeah, you're definitely an oh, alien. Oh, yeah, you're though. definitely an alien. Or you have some strange collection of grotesque physical and mental diseases. Uh. Either way, you need my help. Okay, uh, that much is definitely true. I'm pretty sure I heard a monster scratching at the door. <laughs> He's probably hungry. Anyway, man, if you're an alien, we've got to get you out of here. The 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 heiress. How do you pronounce that word? Eris. I'm sorry. Yes, the heiress. Sorry, I'm just not the smartest tool in the shed. The heiress hates aliens. Uh, <laughs> the what? The the heiress. Oh, uh, well, she's awful and controls everything basically. I mean, I doubt she's ever met one. But to hear her talk, she hates aliens as much as she hates lowbloods, which I guess you also are. You're practically a member of the resistance already. Uh, I'm not sure whether I should be really confused or really concerned about you. <laughs> Do you need help? <laughs> One time when things got really bad with my brother, my babysitter took him to a doctor and it seemed to help. Uh, what's a brother? What's a babysitter? What's a doctor? <laughs> That's a lot of things that uh, are all going to need help. You want to say what's a doctor? You're just gonna I, I think what's a brother is good. Ah, uh, okay, that's fair. What's a brother? Wow, you are so lucky. <laughs> <laughs> I really don't know. Uh, okay, I'm definitely concerned. Being concerned is what friends do for each other. I've never had anyone but Tetra Damic be concerned about me before. Oh, jeez. I bet the other Tetrarchs will be extremely excited to hear there's an alien helping us out now. Oh, yeah, because, like, Tetrarch to Mech, because it's supposed to be... That's what I was thinking, right? Because, like, all names are... Aren't they supposed to be six letters each? So, yeah. Tetrarch is... That's more. That's, that's you know, eight Tetrarch. Probably a code name. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. But Damic is actually, like, his real name. Right. Uh, sure. But I'm sort of pretty focused on not being killed by the monster in the other room at the moment. <laughs> uh, that's kind of my main deal right now. I don't really have a lot of time for anything else. You're right. Yeah, of course. I'll help you. And the Tetrarch, too, because, well, I think... Okay, I hope this is also helping him somehow. Which reminds me, we really shouldn't be talking like this. Uh, like what? Tetrarch Damic says we always have to assume our communications are being monitored. And this is exactly the kind of conversation I shouldn't be having. Oh, man, I better hurry up and get over there. On my way now. Please don't message me anymore. It's dangerous. BRB. In person. I mean... <laughs> oh, yeah, look, it's a freak. That's totally a poster of us. The grubbles, the grubbles. If you buck, we won't trouble to resist their own fists while you sift through the rubble. <laughs> that was nice. That's pretty good. That was good. Bars. It's sort of hard to spit your quasi revolutionary rhymes with any real fire while dressing your butler uniforms, though. Damic says you're subversively transforming the rags of your oppression into the fatigues of the revolutionary through your jams, but we kind of worry your performances will be drowned out by sarcastic orders to polish silver. Ah. Huh. So you guys uh, are musicians also. Huh. It's kind of cool. So that's like an official poster made of the two of you. Yeah. In your music outfits. <laughs> well, although we didn't do much, I think next time we're is gaming, we're going to do our best to get over so that we can actually have two characters interacting, which for Homesick standards is in fact not all that normal. Also, I think I, think I could just... I hey! can go between the two of them. That's kind of cool. I mean, I don't, ha, I don't just think she has very much to do yeah. right now. Okay, next time we're this game, we're definitely going to explore more. Um, once again, I want to really do really, really big shout out to Carson for helping us to play this game. You yeah, know, to, very fun. Yeah, this is great. I'm really enjoying this so far. I hope you all are too. Uh, to anyone who's watching this on the day that it comes out, happy Homestuck Day, 413. Happy I, Homestuck. I'm always just looking forward to all the fan art that comes out on these days because it's just, it's great. Yeah, everybody forgets to be ashamed that they're a homestuck for one brief 24-hour period. It's true. And you know what? It makes for a really, really good day. So it does. Next time on Borderlands Gaming, 
Uh, I hope to see you there. Thank you so much for watching the video. Uh, if you want to help the series out, every like honestly does so much more than you would actually ever believe. And I hope that I will see you all in the next part of Hype Swap. Yeah. And last minute BLG question of the day. Ooh. Who's your favorite troll? True. Bye, everyone. <laughs>